Hi, in this video we will see what is Zoho invoice, how to create an invoice transaction, how to add an expense, how to record time and bill your clients, the list of reports available within Zoho invoice and finally let's talk about the other features. Zoho invoice is a simple invoicing platform where you can create and send professional invoices to your customers and collect payments. You can customize the look and feel of your invoice. You can set up automated reminders to remind customers to pay you on time. You can keep track of the time you spend and bill your customers. And Zoho Invoice also helps you to keep track of the list of expenses you have incurred. Let's log in. You can access all the key features from the left navigation panel. The dashboard gives you insights on total receivables, your sales and expense graph over time, your top expenses, the list of projects, their unbuilt hours, etc. This section will help you to add and manage your business contacts. If you have a list of contacts with you, you can simply click on this button and import them. Products and services that you sell can be created and viewed under this item section. You can create different price lists for the same items here. You can manage your list of estimates here. You can convert an estimate to an invoice in a simple click of a button. You can manage your advance payments under the Read an Invoice section. You can manage your list of invoices here. You can track them with status such as Draft, Send, Overdue and Paid. You can also manage invoice approval stages before sending the invoice across to your clients. Your payment receipts will be available here. You can download them or print them using these options. You can manage customer returns and credits here in this Credit Notes section. You can manage the list of business expenses here. You can associate an expense towards a particular project or you can also bill your customers for the expenses you have incurred on behalf of them. The timesheet section in Zoho Invoice will help you to create and manage projects involving different tasks and users. You can track project hours and raise an invoice for them. The report section holds close to 30 plus reports spanning every aspect of your business transaction, breaking down the data into concise information. The search option provided here will help you to find any data within Zoho Invoice quickly. You can either click on this plus new button here and choose the transaction or you can click on the plus new button right next to the particular module to create a new transaction. You can quickly access the recent transactions under this icon. You can manage accounts for multiple companies from within Zoho Invoice. To add a new company, click on this Manage option and click on Add Organization. Click on the gear icon in the top right corner of the screen to configure your business profile. You can invite users to work with you. You can customize each and every section in Zoho Invoice under Preferences, where you can specify how you would like to add discounts to your invoices. You can add custom fields for the transactions, etc. You can manage the taxes and its preferences here. You can customize your invoice template here in this section. You can set up invoice payment reminders in this section. Zoho Invoice is connected with multiple payment gateways. You can connect with one to collect payments online. You can back up your entire company data in a single click of a button in this section. For any help regarding Zoho Invoice, you can always view our help document by selecting help docs here. Or you can contact support for any further assistance. You can either send us an email or chat with us directly. Let's quickly create an invoice. If you have already created an estimate to your client, you can simply convert that estimate to an invoice in a simple click of a button. As you could see, all the information is automatically filled in. You can either save this invoice in a draft format or send it out across to your client directly. Or you can also configure estimate settings in such a way that when your customer accepts an estimate, Zoho Books will automatically convert them to an invoice and will also send them across to your customers. Or you can head to the Invoices tab and click on this plus new icon to create an invoice from scratch. Let's start by adding the customer for whom you are invoicing. If you have already added this customer in your organization, Zoho Invoice will list them here or you can also click on this option to create a new customer. Invoice number can be order generated or manually added each time. You can choose one of the default payment terms here or simply specify the exact date on which you expect the payment by selecting custom option. If you would like to associate a salesperson, 
you can click here to add or choose one. Choose the item for which you are invoicing here. If you have already created this item, Zoho invoice will list them. You can also click on this plus new icon to create a new one. Enter the item quantity. Rate and tax will be automatically added. You can click and edit them if you like. Add discount, shipping charges and adjustments as per your requirement. Zoho invoice is integrated with major online payment gateways. Payment gateway which you have added under the settings will be listed here. You can simply check the box to associate them. You can also configure or add a new payment gateway right from the section. You can set the terms and conditions under preferences so that you don't have to add them every time when you create a transaction. You can modify them if you wish and check this box so that Zoho invoice remembers it and uses it for the future transactions. Default template will be associated automatically. You can click here to choose the other template which you have created. To customize and create a new template, go to settings, click on templates and choose the template of your choice and then customize the template. You can change the display name, font size, font color, you can add header image, footer image, add authorized signature, etc. You can completely customize this template and we can also mark this template as a default one so that whenever you create a new transaction, this template will be automatically taken into consideration. Once you have filled in all the information, you can save this invoice as a draft or you can send it out directly. This is a preview of an invoice which you have created. You can edit the invoice, print or download them using these options. You can record offline payment using this record payment button. And when you click on more, you will find other options. You can add your notes or comments with respect to this invoice here. This is exactly how an email which you sent across to your client will look like. You have complete control over the content of this email. You can go to preferences and click on email templates and configure them. Your customers can click on this link which will display the invoice. They can click here to pay for this invoice. Client portal is a separate space in which customers can log in and collectively see the list of invoices and estimates which you send to them. So customers don't have to search through their mailbox to pay for your invoices anymore. While creating the organization, by default, the portal for your organization will be created. You can configure the client portal under settings. Now, to give access to your clients, when you create a customer, simply check this box. Or if you have already created the customer, you can click here and enable client portal. Your customers will receive this email. They will have to click on this link and create a separate password for the portal. When they log in, they can see the list of estimates, invoices, project information, etc. They can use this box to comment on a particular transaction which will be displayed here, just over the top of the invoice in your Zoho invoice application. You can comment back here, which will be displayed in the client portal. Your customers can simply click on this button and make a payment. When your customer makes a payment online, a payment receipt will be automatically created in the payment receipt section and the invoice will be marked as paid. In case of offline payments, you can click on this record payment button and enter the amount here followed by other details and simply save them. You don't have to manually remind customers to pay you on time. Zoho invoice allows you to set up automated payment reminders based on the due date of an invoice or the expected payment date. Let's set up reminders based on the due date. Choose the from address here and name for this particular reminder. Select whom to remind, whether you, your customer or both. Now, say for example, if you'd like to remind your customer two days prior to the due date of an invoice, simply enter two here and select before in this section. Add subject and customize the email content based on your requirement. You can insert placeholders. For example, when you choose the balance placeholder, this placeholder will replace itself with the appropriate invoice balance when the email is triggered. Once done, save this. Likewise, you can customize and add multiple reminders. 
You can manage your list of expenses here. Click on this plus new icon to add a new expense. Choose the date and category. You can also add a new category right from the section. Choose the currency and enter the amount. Here choose the tax. If you'd like to specify the list of items which contributes this expense, you can click on this itemize option and specify them line by line. Add the reference number and notes based on your requirement. You can upload your expense receipts using this upload receipt option here. You can also upload it from cloud services such as Zoho Docs, Google Drive, Dropbox, Box, OneDrive, etc. Choose the customer from the dropdown if you would like to associate them. If you wish to build your customer back on this expense, say if this expense is incurred on behalf of the customer and if you'd like to add this expense in an invoice which you would be raising for that customer, you can check this box. Now you can convert this expense to an invoice in a single click of a button or while creating an invoice for this particular customer, you can associate this expense. Once done, save it. The timesheet section in Zoho Invoice will help you to create and manage projects involving different tasks and users. Click on the plus new project button, enter the project name and description. Choose the customer and the billing method. If this is a fixed cost for the project, enter the total amount here. If this is based on project hours, enter the rate per hour here. If this is based on task hours, add the list of tasks here and add the rate per hour for these tasks right here. If this is based on staff hours, add the list of users who will be working in this particular project and then enter the rate per hour for these users. Once done, click save. Click on log time and enter the number of hours you have worked on a specific task. Or you can click here to enter the start time and the end time. Or even before you start with a particular task, you can click on start timer and once you're done with the task, you can click on stop timer and Zoho Invoice will automatically record the number of hours you worked in. If you have any expenses which you have incurred with respect to this project, you can click here and add that expense. Once done, you can click here to bill your client. You can choose how you would like to display the information in the invoice. You can show one particular line for the entire project or if you would like to display individual timesheet entries as line items, you can choose this option. Choose the tax here and check this box if you would like to include all the unbilled expenses. As you could see, all the information has been already added. If you would like to add additional information, you can add them and send this invoice across to your customer. Please take a look at the other features available within Zoho Invoice. Hope this video helped you understand Zoho Invoice and its features better. Let us know if you need any further assistance. Send your emails to support at the rate zohoinvoice.com or call our helpline. Thank you.